Also breaking right now, the family of South Georgia teen found dead in a gym mat almost 10 years ago, speaking out against a recent ruling just yesterday that's closing the case. This is the father of Kendrick Johnson. This is Kenneth Johnson. Let's listen in. The findings what happened to Willie Jane Williams. The same thing that this sheriff department will do again and again if the people do not stand up and fight for what is right and make them do what's right. This is the sheriff department known to cover up, known to cover up things. When you had Willie Jane Williams laying inside this jailhouse, dying, and this same sheriff allegedly cover up what happened to Willie Jane Williams and the same thing that he come back and trying to do now. Sheriff Edna Pope, you didn't have anything to do with it as you say. But the lies you put on this paper made you just a part of the cover up and the conspiracy of what's going on in my son's case. And I will fight as long as I have to to uncover what exactly happened to Kendrick Johnson. People, do not take my word for it. Do your research. So where do you guys go from here? What's your next step? We keep pushing. We have we have students was at the schoolhouse that year. They are reaching out to us. And that's what I want to say to the students. You have in the end, if you have any information, contact the sheriff department. I say to the students, do not go in alone. Do not go in from an attorney around here in Lyons County. Record everything you say to these people so they won't try to turn it around and make you out of a liar. Send it to the Justice Department. And this is Kenneth Johnson, the father of Kendrick Johnson, who was found almost, uh, it's been almost a decade now, found rolled up in a gym mat in Lowndes County High School. Uh, yesterday, the sheriff there saying that there was no foul play suspected in this case after going through 17 boxes of evidence in this case. We're going to continue to follow the story for you and have you have more on CBS 46 News beginning at 3. And we'll also have it on our free streaming app.